Up until the mid-90s, the only way to ventilate a plain tile roof was to use traditionally a slate vent. These were usually hooded, but architects demanded that they wanted something that wasn't seen. Eubank were one of the first to introduce an inline plain tile vent, which is the UB8. The UB8 plain tile vent is an injection moulded unit with a free vent area of 6,250 square millimetres. It comes in four colours and is designed to be used as a void ventilation at high and low level in a cold roof void. It has bird stop and a grill at the back to stop nesting insects. If that's removed, you can attach the adapter which would make it to the UB37, which can be connected to the soil pipe and for ducting of small vents. Installing the UB8 plain tile vent uh, requires no batten cutting whatsoever, according to the fixed instructions. You would measure out uh, where you need to position it, a line of 300 along, 70 mil deep, and then you cut a little triangle out, which I will do in a moment. Right, I've marked the roof up, as I mentioned before, 300 by 70 drop. I'm now going to cut through the felt. Then it needs to be fixed into the batten above, usually with a tack now. I've fixed the uh, felt to the batten above. I'm now going to position the UB8, which should be roughly into the roof, and then address the tiles around it. To get the correct position where it will be. And then finishing it off. This would normally be obviously all nailed and screwed down if necessary to meet the new BS5534 fixing guide. and the rest of the roof would be done pro rata. Where clay roofs are installed perhaps in conservation areas or listed buildings, plastic being installed in that roof would be unacceptable. Eubank have made the UB8 what is called the clay slip, which allows the tiles that are on the roof to be adhered to on the actual unit itself, so it totally colour matches the roof, seeing very little or absolutely no plastic at all.